Introducing What's Country in Vegas, the show to watch for the inside scoop on some of the hottest country celebrities. You'll get a private tour of intriguing historical locations in and around Las Vegas and go behind the scenes at the most talked about country events in town. It's your ticket to everything country in Vegas. Come share the ride with your host, Tina Montana. Hey, welcome to What's Country in Vegas. I'm Tina Montana, your host, and I'm getting ready to interview miniature bull riders this year at the South Point. So I want you to stay tuned. These kids are excellent. Now for next feast your eyes on old floor here in the Raptors of the South Point Arena. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hear. <laughs> South Point, and I'm with my first miniature bull rider. He's in the Pee Wee division, and his name is? Parker Crenshaw. Oh, Parker's got a great name. Parker, mm -hmm. tell me where you're from. Uh, I'm in, I live in Oklahoma. Okay, and what part of Oklahoma? Uh, southeast part. Southeast part. Do you got any fans out there? Um, yes, ma'am. All right, so tell me about this win that you had. This has got to be very exciting. First time in Vegas? Uh, no, ma'am. I was here out. I was out here last year at the Junior NFR. At the Junior FNFR. Oh, wow. So you're kind of a veteran. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Kinda. <laughs> kinda. So let's talk about your win today. How does it feel to be a winner? Good. It feels really good. Okay. Tell me about the ride. Tell our fans out there what's it like to ride one of these bulls. Uh, it's really fun once you get the hang of it. Well, how do you get the hang of it? Practice. All right. Can you show me some of those practicing moves? Well, you gotta get on a buck and barrel, just anything makes you better. Do you like get limbered up? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so for all your fans out there who wanna become miniature bull riders, can you give them any advice? Just do what you love and don't give up. Don't give up, I think I like that. Do we have any questions out there for any of the fans? Yeah, where are we gonna see you next year? Um, maybe here again. Maybe here again in the winner's circle. Well, I also want to let you know that Diamond D Ranchware has paired with Resist All, and we're here to give you a brand new Resist All cowboy hat. What do you think of that? Sounds good. <laughs> you think you can wear a Resist All cowboy hat? I guess so. Okay, anything for free, anything for the winner? Let's give him a hand. Thank you. Thank you, sir. See you next time. here today he is Ethan Winkler Ethan Winkler and you are part of the junior division yes yes ma'am okay now how long have you been riding since I was three wow so how does a three-year-old decide um, I'm gonna ride bulls miniature bulls well my brother rode sheep and I've always wanted to be better than him at everything well this is about the only better thing I'm good at than him really and is your brother here today no ma'am Okay, do you think he's watching? Uh, yes, ma'am. Okay, so tell our fans out here, what was your ride like today? How did you get to the winner's circle? Uh, just, I rode my bull, stayed square, and didn't have the best ride, but still got, still got the win. You still got the win. So I see all these guys out here practicing on these barrels and these mechanical bulls, and there's hands going up in the air just like this. Can you tell me, why do you do that? That helps you keep your balance and just helps you stay in the middle of the bull. Okay, and then tell me about the bull that you chose. You, you chose a couple bulls this week. Well, we don't get to choose, we have to draw them. And I drew some rank ones and some good bucking, good buckers. Okay, what's a rank bull versus a good bucker? I, I need to know this. So a good bucker just jump kicks, nice timing, easy to ride. A rank one is like turning back where he spins. Mm -hmm. 
and it's just harder harder to ride than a jump kicker. Than a jump kicker. Which one do you prefer? Uh, the rank ones, Raleigh. He prefers the rank ones. All right. Well, because of your win this week, I'm paired off with Diamond D Ranchwear and Resist All to give you a brand new cowboy hat that you can wear all year long during your competitions. Yes, ma'am. What do you think of that? Oh, I like it. That's pretty neat. <laughs> do you have a special hat that you'd want to wear? I just got to see them. I mean, I would wear a special hat if I got one. Yes, ma'am. Okay. I want to thank you for tuning in on this one. See you soon. Yeah. So I've got my next winner here in the senior division, and tell us who you are. I'm Lance Laura. I uh, just won the world for the senior division. Just won the world for the senior division. That's quite an accomplishment. Yes, ma'am. Okay, how does that feel? It feels good. I mean, worked my butt off all year. Oh, you're a hard worker. Yes, ma'am. All right, so let's talk a little bit about the bowl and the ride. You're in the senior division. So that means you're a little seasoned. You've rode a few bowls in your life, so you know how to stay on. You've exercised. Just kind of give us um, give us a rundown of what it takes to get to this point all year long. Uh, it takes practice. You have practice all season, every time. Every time. And um, tell us, is there a lot of bucking bowls in Texas? Yes, ma'am. Everything's big in Texas. <laughs> yes, ma'am. <laughs> All right, so I, I like your uh, I like your garb here. Your seat. You've got a lot of sponsors. Yes, Tell me about your sponsors. Uh, well, this is one of my most main ones that uh, help really help me get to Vegas, and then uh, Ruffy. Is there anything on the backside? Mm -hmm. Oh, he's got a little one back here too. So like, there you go. And then one thing I did notice, I really like this hat here. But let's turn to the camera and show them. What this hat is? This is—is is this Philippians 4:13? Yes, ma'am. Do you know that verse by heart? Yes, ma'am. Could you repeat it for me? I could do all things through strength, through Christ who strengthened me. Christ is your strengthening, right? Yes, ma'am. It's all about God, family, and America. Yes, ma'am. And I think that's really important. Yes, well, I want to congratulate you today um, for your win. For this, you've worked very hard for this. Yes, is there anything that you can tell the fans out there, or other other guys or kids like you that are, are wanting to do this? What, what kind of advice could you give them? Uh, just. Work your hardest and you'll accomplish it. And you'll accomplish it, okay. Yes. And then, and for your efforts, uh, did you win a buckle? Yes, no, oh. this is a few years back. That's Ted, yeah, one more time. This is uh, from another rodeo. Oh, 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 that's okay, we won't talk about that one. <laughs> <laughs> but we will talk about Resist All. Resist All is paired off with Diamond D Ranch Wear, and we want to give these winners a beautiful hat to wear all year long, sort of their hard work. So if you could just kind of hold that box up there, let's give Resist All our sponsor. Well, is there anything that you can say to all these folks watching here as we walk away? What, what are we going to expect next year? Uh, I guess I'll uh, see y'all later. How about another win? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> see you again next year, folks, in the Winter Circle. It's Vegas 2018 PBR in conjunction with MBR. This is a rising sport, and we hope that you'll support us. And remember to keep it real and keep a country in Vegas. By the way, Tina Montana, I'm a two-time world champion for the NBR. Next, this is my last year in it. Uh, next year I'll be moving to the PBR. Uh, see y'all later. I want to thank one of my sponsors, Ellen Michael Leatherworks. That's ellenmichaelusa.com. Isn't this jacket gorgeous? You got to get it. This is Tina Montana with What's Country in Vegas, and I actually found a special guest here at the South Point. She's the only girl bull rider currently in the NBR. Wow, what's your name? Nasia Knight. Oh, that's a pretty name. Now, how does the only girl come here to ride bulls? How does this happen? Well, my dad and brother are actually bull riders, so I started with them. She started with them, and I think you told me you've been riding for, what, three years? Yes, ma'am. Three years in the MBR and four years in total. Oh, do any of those guys razz you at all? <laughs> no, ma'am. No, only when you win? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> now, what do you do when they do razz you? Um, I don't know, just... You don't pick know. on them or anything? <laughs> no. <laughs> they don't pick on you? No, because they know I can beat them up. Oh, she can beat them up. Okay, so is that oh, true? John's <laughs> my best friend. Oh, okay, she does have a best friend here, I guess, on the team. So, <laughs> uh, you know, how does a girl get into this event, extreme sports, 
and start practicing. What do you do to get to this point? Um, well, I have a homemade barrel at home, so I practice every day, and then the Leos took a chance on me, and I'm, so I'm here. And she's here, and she says she has a lot of extracurricular activities besides school. You do what? I do volleyball, basketball, softball, track, dance, and gymnastics. Okay, she does it all. Okay, this girl is, is a jack of all trades, right? Right? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> And an A student? Yes, ma'am. Okay, and I had to wear my lucky hat here. You know, red is the color, right? <laughs> yes, yes it is. It's the color here for NBR. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Uh, so tell anybody out there, again, we always like to tell our fans, if anybody, like especially kids, want to get into this. Oh, 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 wait. We got a buckle. All right, wait, wait. Can't, uh -oh, uh -oh. Tell us about your buckle. I won it in Lapine, and um, I was the only girl riding. And so then I made the full eight seconds, and the boys were so ashamed that a girl won. <laughs> the boys were so ashamed that a girl won. Okay, show us it. Show it the camera. You can get a little close up on that buckle. I, I almost saw her tipping over just a little <laughs> bit, you know, with balancing because that buckle is so heavy. <laughs> well, all I got to say is um, I'd like to win a buckle. Do you think there's any chance for me at my age that I could win a buckle? Um, you might be able to buy one. <laughs> okay, I can I just know. buy one. Oh, that's all I get for this. Uh, you know, so I always like to tell our fans out there, how do you inspire others to become like more like you? Um, just to let all the girls know that boys are not the only ones that can do bull riding. Girls can do it too. Girls can do it too. All right. I want to thank you guys again for tuning in. Hey, this we're breaking records here over in Las Vegas. This is what's country in Vegas. We always tell our fans to keep it real and always keep it country. Remember Vegas, keep it real and keep it country. for tuning in to What's Country in Vegas and being at the South Point with us for the miniature bull riding. You know, we believe in America, we believe in God, and we believe in our youth. They are the future. So always remember, folks, to keep it real and keep it country.